There we go. The truck is looking spotless. Let's throw some tire shine on there and we'll be good to go. It's going to need a lot of it too. We're going to be heading to a rough place today. It's an abandoned parking garage and uh, it's a really beat up place. They got garbage all over the place. There's concrete breaking. So the place is about to collapse just on top of that. So it's a pretty bad investment, but uh, I had decided to buy it because if we get lucky, then uh, we'll be able to make that up. But uh, anyways, I'm up in the house. Let's go ahead and lock everything up. We'll be good to go. We're going to take the trailer with us again today and the 6x6, six six, of course. There we go. Fire it up. Now we can back it in. All right. Looks good. Let's not take any of our uh, garage doors out. Perfect. Okay, we pull it out. Looks good. All right. Well, we're good to head out here and uh, it's right down the road, which is convenient. So if we do find anything, we'll be able to bring it back home and store it in our garage. So that's the plan. If you guys enjoyed today's video, drop a thumbs up. I really do appreciate it. And subscribe. Let's see if we can hit 70,000 subs before the new game comes out. Farm Sim 22, which if you're interested in pre-ordering, I have a link down below using our affiliate link and you guys can help go to the channel. All the money you raise from that will be going towards giveaways. So let's see how much we can raise to get people the game if they can't get it. But you can see the place over here. Like I said, it's really rough. Oh my gosh. It already looks rusted out on the windows. I guess we'll just see. Looks like there's a lot of dead trees we're going to have to knock out. And, uh, oh, wait, I forgot to pick up something. Right down the road is Tractor Supply Co., and we're going to pick up a forklift. So swing by, we'll pick it up real quick, but you got a preview of it. It looks pretty bad. So here we are. We got a little forklift here for the garbage. And this thing should get the job done. Oh, buddy, uh, something's wrong with that trailer. And yeah, whatever, we'll get this on there. Oh my gosh, it's still running on the trailer. I forgot to turn it off. All right, well, whatever. We're going to get really good use of it. We'll run that thing down to E, that's for sure. Tractor supply will return that bad boy. won't be able to move it to the gas station. Okay, now we can officially pull in, and we're going to take the opposite side, the interstate side. Oh, there we go. Okay, loop over. It looks good. This map is brand new. If you check it out, it looks pretty sweet. It's built by DJ Modding. Uh, Red River Valley is the name of the map. Sweet map. Probably one of the best before the game comes to an end in Farm Sim 19. Okay, we're going to get our ramps down here. Looks good. Let me grab the forklift and uh, we'll go do a little bit of a ground check and see if we can find anything special. There we go. Let's go ahead and park it here. Turn on our little beacon too. That looks sweet. All right. Well, let's start from the front. Oh my gosh. There's just piles of junk everywhere. Well, to start it off, there's a lot of driveway issues. Look like there's grass growing through it. Someone wants to plant some seeds or something. We've got garbage piles all over the place, and I saw a tent over there. So, uh, there's probably a homeless person living around here, so we'll have to investigate that. And probably in the building, too. But uh, right here, we got... It looks like they're on, like, pallets, so we'll be able to pick some stuff up. Oh, my gosh. Just piles of garbage here. This must have been a landfill. We got some steel here. Some of it can be salvageable, and uh, we can sell it. Yeah, this, these bricks are just totaled, so we can't sell those, but... Some old tires, you know, we can put those on semis and stuff, but... Oh, buddy. Looks like we got a little bit of swamp going on here. Yeah, just crazy junk all over the place. This is this is not cool. And then we got a Portageon. Oh, my God. Oh, there's another one. You got to be kidding me. Okay, well, we got to get two full Portageons out of here and a telephone booth. All right, cool. Well, uh, that's a lot of work we got to get done today. And we got table saws. You know, those might be nice. I don't think they run. Let's take a little uh, hike. Oh, wait, there's a motorcycle. Oh, my gosh, this thing's kind of nice. I doubt it runs. The battery's definitely dead. I mean, this place has been abandoned. Yeah, it, there's no way. It kind of turns over. But then, yeah, there's no, there's not enough juice. Ooh, oh, my gosh, get a workout. Into, oh, buddy, who uh, put this tree in the middle? Oh, that's a dead tree, too. Okay, well, let's head up here. Uh, empty parking spots. Lights probably don't work. Ooh, there's an old truck right here. What's this thing? An F piece of dirt. I don't know what this is. Uh, uh, F100 maybe? No, no, that looks like a 1970s. It's a classic Ford. It's in pretty good condition. It's got flats on it. Those tires need to be replaced. Oh, shoot. What is this? I saw a color. I thought that was the frame of the car. Oh, my. Is this a Lamborghini? Yes, sir. That is a Lamborghini. Check that out. The Countach. Oh, my gosh. There's keys. Usually they put them in the gas cap, so if I can... Oh, yep, here it is. Pop it open. Jump on it. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, uh, pull it on. Yep, Lamborghini key. Uh, so the battery's obviously dead, but we can probably try and jump it. We'll see. It's got airbags on it. I can just tell from uh, from the bottom here. Let's go ahead and 
can see right there, there's airbags tacked away in there. It's pretty sweet. Let me try and get in it. Oh, yep, I fit. That's good. Okay, here we go. Let's fire it up. Oh, it starts and it's still running. Hold on, let's rev it a little bit. Airbags are working. They got two switches in here. Yeah, this thing's nice. All right, let's take it for a spin so it doesn't die. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this thing's nice. Here, we can lower it down like a street racer. And it's got like the uh, the tires come out too. Spacers. That's sweet. Okay, let's go park it back up for now. I'm going to leave it run and let it charge up. Truck definitely does not start. Yep, nothing. This thing's dead. I'm pretty sure I got to check it. It's probably a Ford F100, like I said. Maybe a 72. That's, you know, I looked at the bumper and those came in 72. So, yeah, probably right. Uh, looks like just an empty trailer up here. Not much. Let's see what's over here. There's a door for the emergency exit. Nothing, just some staircases. Okay, well, that's just about it. And uh, let's go ahead and over here, see if there's any like landscape supplies in here. That Lamborghini is loud, man. I can hear, oh wait, why is there a red is there a Ferrari in there? What? That's a Ferrari. Wait a minute. Hold on a second. I gotta check this out. Back of the tr oh my goodness. You're kidding. This is a La Ferrari. No, you're you're lying. Why why is this in here? Explain to me. Why would they put a Ferrari in a landscape trailer? Oh my gosh. Guys, this is a 2.9 million dollar Ferrari. Um um we just we just have one. We own it too. Everything in the property we own. It was in the in the disclosure agreement. Okay, I I officially am a Ferrari owner. All right, well, the only right thing to do is to get in it. Please start. Please start. Oh, my gosh. It sounds so good. This is way better than that Lamborghini. Okay, how are we going to get it out of here? Uh, I'll do my best. Don't scratch it. Come on, turn it. There we go. We're just right about there. Okay, I got it over. Let's drive up the yeah, back end. Look at this thing. Lights are sweet on it. I got the tint on it. Let's open everything up real quick. Oh, look at that door. Butterfly door. Got an engine hood here. Let's let it uh, air out. I bet it's pretty hot still. And we got a frunk up here. That's cool. No way. That's absolutely killer. Okay, well, uh, yeah, I'm a Ferrari owner. Let's hop in it. We'll take it for a spin down the street. Yeah, this thing's sweet. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's not scratch anything. Oh, dang it. The Lamborghini died. Okay, it. whatever. We'll charge it later at our house. But we got to get two vehicles back. Plus that motorcycle. And then... Uh... Oh my gosh, I just drifted around the corner. Okay, let's take it down the highway. Drive through. Oh, I just hit the wall. Dang it. Okay, we're good. Uh, let's drive down. Oh yeah, buddy. This thing's sweet. All right, let's pull around. Oh, I can't believe we won a Ferrari, boys. And now we can go back to Rich Guys Racing. If you ever heard of that series, I did a while ago. And we got some new cars. I just won for free. So, uh, let's load it on the trailer. And we got to clean up a bunch of junk, too. So, uh, the forklift. Let's let's go get the Portageons out of here. And I'm going to load those on first. And then we'll take a car. Those Porta Johns are nasty. Okay, well, here we go. Go in the back. I think it's right there. Push it around. Pretty good at operating a forklift. Okay. Oh, this thing smells like nasty. Okay, we got to get it on the trailer. If I spill this on my Ferrari, I am going to freak. Okay, uh, there we go. I think we can be able to throw a strap down on the door, though, too. It won't fly open. There we go. I got a strap over the top and over the door. So that'll be good. Let's go ahead and back this out. We'll work on it a little bit more when we get back. But I want to get the cars to my house. Well, I'm going to get the Ferrari back to the house. And we'll come back here and clean everything up. Maybe do a part two of this abandoned series if you guys do enjoy it. So, anyways, I'm going to get the Ferrari back. Get it. Okay, if we go back out on the highway here. There we go. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. Come on. Hey, be quiet, Karen. I'm driving a Ferrari. Hey. Well, guys, that's it for today's video. I got a, a full Portageon with uh, other people's stuff in it and my Ferrari on the back. So, 
that's day one complete. We're going to come back, maybe do a cleanup video if you guys do end up enjoying this one. Remember to show me that you did, drop a like, and subscribe to the channel. It shows me you want more, and I really do appreciate it. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Wait, Canada?